bass. I'm gonna go ahead and make this the intro to uh, Captain K, man, because it was a few things that I wanted to say, a few key things. Uh, for one, uh, the fall of the angels, the sighting of the fall of the angels and the visions of Enoch, not Enoch, I know that sounds too African for you, is the first appearance of the white man. And like I was trying to say in the video that you'll see after this, uh, Enoch clearly documents because he was our first uh, journalist, if you will, of the prophets. And uh, he's recording things right now as we speak. But uh, that's another video, perhaps. But uh, he clearly documented that he had seen angels before, so he knew they were angelic beings or the, his immortal brothers of Elohim. But they appeared to be white men, but he didn't know if they were men or women. Now, pause. The angels did not look like the sweet little uh, baby boy angels, naked boy angels, and white girl angels that you see. Um, I went over this in uh, my prior videos from last summer. So this is the sighting of the first, Enoch, the visions of Enoch were the sighting of the first white man. And then in the video um, that you'll see after this, we'll uh, get into it more, but I'm going to make this the, uh, the intro to Captain Caveman, but this is what he saw. He didn't know if they were, he said they appeared to be white men, but he knew they were his immortal brothers. But this was the introduction to the white man on the earth that was saw by the in the visions of Enoch. And if you read the book of Enoch, um, it proves that uh, white people, which history and science are to prove that they have only been on earth 6,000 years. And science proves that we have a, at least a 24,000 head start ahead of them because we've been on earth that science can prove and history can prove 30,000 years. But science and history cannot go back to the beginning of time. But, you know what I'm saying, that's how that's how we know that the earth is at least 30,000 years. You know what I'm saying, so these nerd uh, white boy uh, devil worshippers will tell you that. So again, they appeared to be white men. He didn't know if they were men or women. They appeared to be white men. And this is what he saw. So this is where white watch stems from. Um, you reprobates and either your and also your slaves or not too keen on the, their origins so that's why uh christianity teaches color blindness but it uh it's, it, it, it 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 uh teaches hatred but people will say that i'm hateful but um that's what it's all about so i'll let the the, the video uh that comes behind this which is a little bit longer uh get into it more maybe you'll backtrack and look at this one but this was the sighting of the first white people on earth and was through the visions of Enoch. So that's why the book of Enoch was whitewashed and made no sense. And they heard and got the, got it out of the way. But uh, we got all our ancient scriptures and stuff back. You know what I'm saying? It makes things make sense. Again, they appear to be white men. So that's why Christianity upholds faggot shit. You know what I'm saying? Because of the fallen angels. It was all a mimic and blasphemy to the Most High. Like I said, you don't know if he's a boy or a girl. He's both. Remember I said that in my prior videos. But yeah, this is the intro to Captain Caveman. I am the full-blown Yahoo and Spank and Austin. Spank Tudor. Better Hot.